Hello viewers, I'm SB and welcome back to exactly where we are supposed to be here in Webbed. Uh, it was very easy to make it up the second time actually, it took like no time at all. Thanks to the fact that our web is persistent. I was able to just use the, uh, the strands we had built earlier. Hmm, we reckon is down there. After that last fall, I'm a little, a little gun shy. Come on, can I? It's not really what I was going for. I was just trying to make sure I had something to, uh, something to web back to, potentially. Okay. Ah, darn it. All right, so at this point, maybe we should just accept that most falls are real falls. The game is done messing around. Okay, I was starting to wonder if we were ever actually going to see a beetle. Hey there, friend. Welcome to Dungtown. Wonderful. Great. I'm so glad I made all this effort. Listen, I'm sorry. I shouldn't be judgmental. That was rude of me. Pushing a great big ball of dung is one of the best workouts. Y'all dance? No? I'm the only one? Just a little... Okay. Okay. They're very, um, very work-focused here. Fresh dung is the best dung. That's probably true. Feels like a low bar, though. Hey there, little spider. You heard about dung? <laughs> Have I ever. I can't stop hearing about it. Tasty, nutritious, and burns extra hot. You want some? Well, you're in luck. We've got some friends with loads of dung to share. Just, uh... Not here. It's up the hill a fair way. And, well, there's one small problem with getting up there. Oh, get to the point, Michael. Look, we need to get across these puddles, and I broke my wing a while back. No flying means we're in need of a walking-based solution. Think you could use your fancy web skills to string us a bridge out of them sticks? I can absolutely do that. That sounds great. You just stay right here, and I will figure out how one would do... A thing like that. Uh, okay, this, and then just snap that on here. Okay, brilliant, brilliant. Uh, I assume we're gonna need full coverage, right? Like these are not gonna be sufficient. Sorry, let me, oh no, ah. Let's give this a push. Boy, that really doesn't wanna move. Why are you, why are you being so weird? Okay, well, that'll do, I guess. All right, it's all part of the big brilliant plan. Okay, these are more or less covering the space. And then you just connect to there and bam, it's a bridge. Look, I did it. Uh, yes. Let's give this a go then. See, this one's good. Oh, you're gonna, hold on, are you gonna test them both? Cause like, oh, the, sorry, the side, this one's not, oh no. You said a bridge. I only fixed up one. Oh God. This might work actually, aw. That, that was remarkably close. Uh, well, we do seem to be short a bit of wood, don't we? What's down here? Ah, uh, okay. There we go, there we go, there we go. That answers some questions. What? No, that's the... I just need to pull this through the entrance to the cavern, and we're all set. Almost. Almost. There we go. And it feels like that's probably... Eh, you know what. Let's go get the other piece. I suppose there's no reason not to, right? Like... Alright. 
unfortunately, it doesn't seem to be terribly complicated. Like, they don't want us to do anything wild here. It's pretty much just connect them, right? Hmm. <clears throat> pretty much just... Hmm. <clears throat> This is remarkably difficult. Never mind the thing I was just saying. Sure, that works. Alright, so we need to push this whole assembly that away. Which is turning out to be a little bit of a challenge. a little bit tighter but this is good this is like this is a good start okay I think that'll work I think that's gonna cut it I do feel better about the stability of the first one no no I'm good I, I, I totally got it this time I'm just gonna stand over here and cheer you on. Maybe, maybe make some last minute improvements here, you know, just, just to be sure. Cause we're all friends here and I don't want anything bad to happen to anyone. Can you get up that? Uh, uh, okay. That ain't on me. You didn't tell me you were going to need... Okay, I, that's fine. I got this. I got this. I got this. We're going to give you the help that you need. Ugh. Go! There we go. Sorry, let me break all that. Sorry, sorry, sorry. That counts, right? Well, we can head on up now, after a little rest. We won't beat you to the top, but you'll see our friends. You tell them Wendy and Michael sent you. Are those normal beetle names? They'll be able to get you all the dung you need. I just can't, you know? Well, all right, let's see what that does. I deserve this. I did shoot you a lot of times. I'm, I'm going to just, you know. Okay, back to work. So there's probably nothing over here except for, yeah, except for those little flies. Still, it's hard not to want to look. Yep, okay, nothing. Ah, please, okay. Alright, that'll make that ascent easier in the future. Ah, how did that break? Uh, okay, sturdy enough for now, I guess. It's weird how much more open this segment has been than the rest of the game. It's like in the rest of the game, there was not just, it's not just that the spaces were a lot more enclosed, but there was stuff everywhere to really encourage you to look around those enclosed spaces. Here, it's just like these huge, huge open areas that you are definitely just intended to shoot through as quickly as you can. We 
Thank you. Oh, I almost had it. I almost had it. Again, just in case we ever have to come back. Never mind. I was gonna say, it sort of kind of looks like a place where there might be a secret passage. Oh, all right. Well, we'll just not go down there then. What on earth? What even is this? What is the source of all of these spikes? Who is responsible? And it got me up where I was going. getting very good at that. Those things are going to be extinct before too much longer. This is how spiders eat in the wild. Just a, a healthy amount of no-scoping. There we go. I have no idea where we are going. Is this still up the hill even? Okay, yes, there, there is a holdable surface over here. Hold on, let me try to get back up. I just want to make sure that we're slinging accessible shortcuts everywhere that we can. Okay. Nope. All right. Everything's fine. Okay, here we go. So I could pull that platform up. What would be the value, though? Nah, maybe we'll need to do it later. I mean, this is quite notably the wrong direction. This is definitely a place that we just were. Huh. This was here, just off camera, the whole time. Alright, so sorry, what am I, what am I trying to do here? Because, like, if we put the rocks on that, I'm not, well, maybe I'll be able to make it onto this platform in time as it rises. It doesn't feel very likely. Maybe the idea is that I, like, I create some sort of breakable harness kind of situation so that I, like, prepare to load the, the thing up and drop it and then don't actually do that until I'm ready to jump. This isn't going to work, right? Because I'm not going to be able to bring the rock up through the bottom of the platform anyway. Yeah, we're going to have to break a lot of this stuff. I 
This is this is just gonna be a nightmare. What if? All right. So we lower this enough, but like, what would be the point? Again, what what is the actual point? Because raising this up doesn't get us anywhere new. It doesn't look like. Seems like there's just a dead end up there. Let me hold on. Can we see anything through here? Maybe, maybe way up top you can go left again. And there's this, which I sort of wonder if. I sort of wonder to what degree I could cheat this. I mean, I'm sure they designed this specifically so that would be hard to do. Right, like the angle up there. can't see anywhere near it to try to guess. So we need to get the platform to come up some, but not too much. So that it creates a ledge in that general area. I don't have any idea how we're going to be able to do this. Alright, I'm done with that rock. That rock, I screwed things up too much. Let's, let's use one of these. Actually, you know what? That's kind of fine for right now, just like as a cradle for this thing. Okay, let's straighten you out. A thing I have never desired to do to anything or anyone before. Uh, one rock is not going to cut it. Also, how am I going to stop the rocks from just falling off? Maybe I should only use these ones with the, uh, sort of the square edges. I really wish that the spider would not just, like, slide off of surfaces so easily. Making my life very difficult here, little spider. Yeah, the way everything is like just like super eager to slide off the platform is really frustrating. It takes such a huge amount of web to get anything born up here. If I were now to cut these ropes, none of this stuff would actually fall on the platform. It would, right? It would just it would land on the platform. The platform would list to the side slightly, and then the the rocks would all just fall. There we go. This thing, there's a chance we could keep it up there. Can I create... Hmm. wonder if I could get some guardrails around it. I could just, you know, I could just web all the rocks to the platform. From below, even. Maybe that's a better way of doing this. Rather than try to put things on things, just attach them to each other. Actually, this is almost certainly a better idea, right? I don't know how many of these we need. I'm gonna do like three for each rock, and then I'm just gonna cut all of the stuff above and we're gonna see what happens.
All right. Okay. Three was sufficient, and then now that we're up here, we can create the thing that we will use to get back up here if we ever fall. Yeah, that's way better than trying to balance stuff on the rickety platform. Sigh. Well, this is somewhere else. Hey there, friend. Hello's there, spider. Be very, very quiet. Don't scare the foods. Um, okay. I'm quietly firing web at the foods. Ah! There we go. Quietly playing my siren song. So what's down here? All right, a real nightmare of spikes. And then... Ah. Okay, so this was accessible from... Ow. Is that... There's gotta be more to that room then. We accidentally found our way into a secret place from Probably not the, uh, not the intended side. But no, in fact, this does seem to be all that is here. Oops, yeah, shoot, that's not... That's not productive. And I can't get back up, huh? Nope. The top screen border is impermeable. So okay, this is the this is the consequence for falling, is what the deal is. Alright, well, fortunately we left some lines behind to make things easier on ourselves on the way back up. <laughs> okay. Game being very generous there. Right, this is definitely going to be faster than going up the other way. Well, maybe not. I did leave lines in the uh, in the passage on the left, so maybe that would be faster. But I like the way that this game's like commitment to using your actual engineering means that to some extent, falling is is exactly as punishing as you allow it to be. That's a cool design. We're gonna get anything at all for uh, eating all these, all these little flies. At some point, we gain a uh, gain some length on our spider climbing meter or something. We. strikes me that given the prevalence of large gaps in this, these these uh, areas, I probably shouldn't just swing off the, like, far off the ground like that. I should make sure I can always see the floor.
things are all over the place up here. This is my rage dance. Oh, I got it. Come here, you. I don't want to let myself be pulled down any further. There we go. Presumably, this is where I'm going. Ah. Feels like a mean trick to play, if so. Huh. Different water area. Ah. Very easy to get going, just like a little bit too fast. And the game's controls are really, really responsive. Uh, but there's just a tiny, tiny bit of float in the water. And after how responsive the rest of it is, it feels super weird. I mean, it's a good feeling for underwater controls. It's just takes a bit of getting used to. Whew. So there's just a thing up there. You know what? I should just connect those. Darn it. Climb up the thing. There we go. should be like pretty careful here about how much time we spend on the ground. All right, is this finally the place where all the dung is? How are we going to get it back? Well, I guess back is mostly downhill. We'll just roll it and let it do the work. Howdy, spider. Wendy and Mike sent you, did they? Uh, you must be here for the bounty of dung. Uh, we got some for you right on over here. Only problem is, this dung's a little too comforting. What could you possibly mean by that? Our lazy son is simply refusing to leave the ball. It's so hot out there. Why would I want to leave? Little spider, it's all yours if you can convince him to get out and see a bit of the world. Go on, give it a little push. Okay, I'll just... Do you not... All right, that's fine. I'll just go over you. This is my pushing dance. I don't want to stay attached to any particular point because it is rolling and I'm sure it will crush me. But this is this is working as a strategy. I suppose I could probably have just stayed on top of it and held left. Okay. Huh. Well. I hope everybody's happy. Hi. Sorry to have ruined your entire thing there. Did I seriously just get kicked out of home? I'll just have to live here now, I guess. Help yourself to some dung. It's my favorite for some reason. Very energy dense. I don't know. This, like, other creatures' systems have rejected the dung for a reason, one presumes. Is 
Is that... Is this connected to anything? I don't, this doesn't seem to be actuating a mechanism in any way. Hold on a second. Let me go see what my engineers are up to. Okay, there we go. This is my elevator dance. I don't... This is gonna... We're gonna have to web the dung to the elevator platform. Okay, well, I was gonna attach it more securely than that, but it wanted to go, so here we go. Okay, now the challenge is getting it out from there. Nothing can ever be simple. I guess I'm making an assumption here. Maybe they'll just have the ants bring it up. Maybe, maybe I don't need to do this. Let me just make sure this is secure here and then we'll, uh... Yeah, that branch looks like it'll hold. Wow, what a dramatic entrance. Looks like I have another new friend to share this tree with. He doesn't seem to be leaving anytime soon. And you have all the fuel you'd ever need to go save your boyfriend. This day is looking up for us, hey, buddy? I, yeah, I guess so. I am covered in fecal matter, which is not how I was planning to spend the day, but. All right, so. Attach engine immediately below mouth of balloon can do. Load a ball of dung into engine. Firmly secure pilot platform to balloon. Okay. Yep. Yeah. All right. Well, I mean, this is pretty straightforward. I don't know how many strands of web we're going to need for this. Do you need something? No, not you. I was, uh, I was trying to talk to the bee because it came over here in a very sort of uh, aggressive fashion, I felt like. Okay. Oh, I see. It is going to have to actually lift off the ground. Um, alright. Let's... Hold on. One problem at a time. Let's get this connected now. Okay, this thing is really heavy. Once we get it close enough, it'll just snap right in, right? Okay, that's totally gonna work. I just need to, I need to do a little bit more work here. Get up on the, there we go. doesn't need to be too, too much higher. I don't know how we're going to get it, like, affixed. Ah, so close. Push it up with my spider arms. Also known as legs. Oop, ah, oh, well. Okay. Let's also exert some more pressure like this. Right? This is this is gonna pull us upward a little bit more. Like part of the problem is once the web strands get short enough, they don't provide as much lift. Oh. Okay, close, close, close. Hmm. 
I'm starting to become concerned that this is not a snap-in, that I'm going to have to actually hold this in place like the hoses, which is doable. It's, you know, less, but doable. I think that's as good as that's getting, honestly. Uh, it could maybe be moved, like, this way a little bit. Just, like, a little bit more left. There we go. Yeah, it's not going up anymore. Okay. Uh, so... So wait, do that again? Okay, it starts to show the other one, but then it considers it done. So all that's left is the dom. Okay. Uh, so here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna see if I can't roll this up a little bit. Okay. Now that it's up here, we connect it to that branch. Nope, 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 nope. There we go. And then we can swing it over from there. Ah. So let's get it up a little bit more. So oh, sorry, Moth. Cut that just the very instant that it is safe to do so. I apologize. Okay. Okay. Whew. Easier to do before you raise the platform? Oh, absolutely. Whatever. It's fine. This is probably better, actually. Okay. There we go. <laughs> I did everything in the worst possible order. Hooray. Attachment points to keep the force sort of spread out. Okay. Easy. The thing, uh, right. Now that it's up here, we need to sort of just fix the attachment angle with... Yeah, some of this stuff. So... If I just break all of the web that's connected to, yeah, that might be necessary. All the web that's connected directly to the uh, the actual part that holds the dung. Okay. And then we're almost, almost, almost loaded into the balloon here. Okay, cool. How are we reading? Ready to launch. Oh boy, okay. Yep, this is definitely very safe. I should spin some handrails or something. Leg rails, I guess. Hooray, it's working. Hey, I've got a great idea. Does anybody wanna do some sick skateboard tricks? Here, yeah, get on it, on my back, and then we'll... Now this is what I call an adventure. I was not trying to talk to you, I was trying to get on my skateboard. Okay, that's actually very helpful. I'm sorry that I was rude.
yep, it's definitely a good idea to be on wheels right now. Can I do a trick? Nope. Uh, 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 careful. Not really. I bet if I swung up in the air... Okay, it's kind of a challenge just to stay on the ground. No, nope, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Nobody panic. Check it out, it was a McTwist. I did it. I did it, you all saw it. Woo! <laughs> this is maybe the best video game ever. <laughs> board my board okay storm was not on our forecast do we know what a weather forecast is okay we're doing fine everything's fine just practicing my uh my kick tricks you know do you mind you're definitely gonna push me off the oh no oh no oh tony hawk signed that you're not gonna you're not even gonna try to save it. Not even you're not even gonna try. This is my sad dance. Oh what is this then? Huh, I don't know. I mean beyond impossible, obviously. Bower. The airship won't be able to make it any further with this storm raging. You'll have to continue without us. Go, find your love. We'll meet you on the other side. Okay, yeah. This is... This feels safe. It feels good and safe. Like a... Okay. Very creepy. There is a... Um, there's definitely, like, space below us. Yeah, it doesn't look enterable, actually. Uh, you know what? I know this is maybe a little bit shorter than some of the other episodes have been, but this feels like a very ominous place to, uh, to maybe just sit and think about what we have in store. Uh, so that's gonna be it for us for today. Thank you all so much for watching. When you come back next time tomorrow, perhaps we are finally going to save our boyfriend. Or we're gonna get eaten by a bunch of giant birds that we have no way of defending ourselves against. And we'll see you then.